Well, I'm on my way home from the grocery store. It is Sunday. I didn't end up getting to go to the organic place yesterday because um, by the time I got done at the hair salon and then there was just all this weird traffic everywhere I was going, um, it was like maybe 15 minutes before time for them to close. So I was gonna try that next weekend, but I picked up my glasses, my new glasses, while I was at Walmart getting my groceries. And this is one of the pairs. I got a regular pair, uh, and then I got this pair of transitions. I've never had transitions before that turn dark when you go out. I love these. Uh, it was just so weird. I had forgotten that they were even transitions. And so I picked them up, and then I came outside and I was putting the groceries in the car and honestly y'all I didn't even notice that they had kind of changed to dark it just you know I can still see really clearly all of you that wear transitions this is nothing new to you but of course to me it is it's just there's not this glare that you know I would have without them and I got in the car after I put all my groceries in the back and then I saw them in the mirror and I'm like, oh, they're dark. Uh, so I really like them. These are bifocals also. It turned out I didn't have to get the trifocals that I thought I was gonna have to get, but I really like these. And so I highly recommend them if you've never had transitions. And um, plus I like these new frames that I got. So I'm really happy with this. So I'm gonna uh, go on in, almost home and uh, unload everything and then I'm gonna do a little grocery haul that I will put on here next. All right, see you in a minute. It is such a pretty day out here that I'm sitting out on my patio to eat lunch and Josie's making sure that I didn't bring lunch out for her before she goes to play. This is what I'm having. We had some leftover black eyed peas and then uh, some of the chicken that I just got at Walmart, that shredded chicken, I threw that in there. And just kind of a simple lunch, but it's such a nice day out here that I just thought it would be nice to sit out on the patio and have lunch out here. Enjoy the sunshine. So that's what I'm gonna do. So, I think I'm going to go ahead and end this video here, and uh, I may try to do um, some type of a cooking video. I don't know if I'm going to get to that tonight. I still need to go over and check on my mom, so I'm just not sure if that's going to happen tonight, uh, but I'll try to put one up during the week if I don't get to it tonight, and um, I may also try to go and take a look at Lowe's, or there's also a... Um, there's a local place here, a little local nursery. I may go and check uh, to see what kind of vegetable plants they've got started um, because I just, I, actually I wanted to show you guys one more thing while I'm thinking about it real quick. Just an, um, an idea that I came up with. So I wanna show y'all, this is kind of a money saving idea. We've been um, cleaning out some stuff from the house my mom used to live in, and uh, there was some old uh, furniture, and some of it had been damaged, water damage and stuff. So there was this chest of drawers, and uh, it was pretty much, it was just beyond repair. Um, but what I did was I took the drawers, and I'm going to use them as little raised beds. So let me show you. Let me go ahead and turn. Well, I can't turn the camera around. Let me stop and then I'll turn it around. Okay, so this is one of them. And I mean, it's a beautiful, it was a beautiful piece of furniture. Um, you can see the really nice dovetailing work and everything that was there. And I could have done other stuff with this. I could have made a shelf out of it or whatever, but really what I think I'm gonna do here, I have three of them. The other two are still in the house. And, but I'm gonna clean up this little area right here and I'm gonna just put them right next to 
each other. And to me, they're about the same. Well, they're not quite as as deep as the raised beds that I made, but I'm gonna use them as raised beds. So it was just an idea I had that, you know, if you have some old uh, piece of furniture that maybe you were gonna toss out, if it's something that has drawers, then you could make a raised bed out of that. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have three of them. Again, that's a mess, so I'm gonna clean that up and kind of do them boom, boom, boom. And then over here, inside, that's really kind of a compost pile that I threw together last couple of years. But I threw some bean seeds down in there too, so I'm hopeful that some beans are going to grow along that little wire fencing that I threw up there. And then I'll, this will all be cleaned out and I'll have these three little drawers here. Those will be raised beds to go along with these. So that was just one more idea I wanted to share with you guys before I go for the day. I hope you have a wonderful weekend and um, that you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, please. And um, let me know in the comments um, if there was anything in the haul that maybe you use also in the grocery haul and uh, you know things that you like that are like I said my theme was kind of just convenience and uh, being able to make things quickly this week so if you've got some ideas for things that aren't real expensive but are easy throw together kind of things then share that with me in the comments and give me some more ideas and let's all share ideas with each other so I'm gonna go ahead and I finished up my lunch I'm going to take Josie in and I've got some things I need to do in the house and then I may run up to this little nursery and see what they've got. All right, I hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your weekend and I will see you later. Bye-bye.